Hi. I was drinking my Dr. Pepper when you did that. Pock to Depper. <laughs> Pock to Depper. We're back. We're back. We're back, kids. Episode two. Yeah, two. Maybe. <laughs> Episode two. Episode two. Yeah. We had some... <laughs> <laughs> I did not choke her then. Promise. We had some really, really good feedback from episode one. It was so funny. So funny. So funny. It's got a Y on the end. Funny. Funny. What do you call the police? The popo. <laughs> <laughs> the popo. Messing the head loo. Messing the <laughs> head <loo. laughs> What do you call them? The police? police. Yeah, police. That's how it. Yeah, yeah, that's what we call them. The busies. Busy. <laughs> Don't you sound like a little slang, please? Dibble. The what? The dibble. Dribble. Dibble. Why? Because it's the dibble. Because there used to be a cartoon out ages ago called Top Cat. Yeah. And the policeman in that was called Officer Dibble. Mm. So then everyone just called, round our way, just called the police the dibble. Or pigs. Oh yeah, we call them, we, well no, I, I say we, I don't, but people around the L. Yeah, people in Liverpool call them the pigs. I don't think they're the pigs. Call them the filth. Oh. The dibble pigs. The filth. The filth. So yeah, we had a big reaction to people with the confessions. (gasps) Yes, we did. We've got some good ones. Should we just get right into the confessions? Yeah, why not? Are we doing them all though? Because there was a lot. No, there's one that really stuck out. Right. It's a good one. Right. Should we get right into yeah, it? Yeah, I've not read it. I don't know what it is. You, I know you have. I, I have. Not, I have not gone through him. So this is a new one for oh. Tim. What's the name? It's <laughs> anonymous. <laughs> it's anonymous. It's anonymous. <laughs> Shut up. Anonymous crunch. Nice. Sure. Okay, confession time. Is this yours? No. Okay. Anyway, confession time. I am not proud of this. Not me. The right. listener. The listener. Okay. I saved the lads after the night out. Let's call him Todd. The next morning, I woke up and he was absolutely horrendous. Breath stunk the lot. <laughs> and I snuck downstairs to only say I had no money, no card, but I didn't want to wake him. So I go through his letters to see what the address was. And I was just getting glared at by this cute little boxer puppy. I thought, right, I can't walk home because I had heels and I was miles away. And then I couldn't possibly ask my mum to pay for it. So I remember seeing a huge, big jar of 50 peas and thought, fuck it. <laughs> Not going to see him again and his breath stung, so it's compensation. <laughs> I feel like I know him. <laughs> I, tried I tried to open it and it was one of them coded ones. So there was only one thing I could do. I took the jar and ran down the stairs, jingling oh. away. I got the taxi and just give the driver the entire pot. To this day, I don't know how much was in there. It wasn't loads, like probably less than £40. Oh. I also think of his dog till this day. I should have took that too. <laughs> <laughs> that is the best confession oh, ever. Oh, God, I feel so bad for Todd. Oh, I don't, though, to be honest, because... I mean, brush your teeth. Yeah? Brush, come on, brush your teeth, lad. That is just genius. How would you have handled that situation, though? I would have definitely took the dog. <laughs> yeah. The dog would have been well worth more than the box of 50 peas. Then you'd have, you'd have the head loo after you. The head loo. I would have come up with a better name than Oh, you could have paid though. for the taxi with the dog. Don't know. Don't That's know. a bit sly, actually, isn't it? Maybe not. Sly, that. He might not have let the dog in, to be honest. Yeah. What do you do? I mean, she handled it the best she could, really, didn't she, I think? I mean, she was presented in a situation. Yeah. She dealt with it. Well done, her. Yeah. Or him. Or him. We don't know. But it's anonymous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I loved that one, though. Thanks uh, for sending that in, Claire. That... Joking. <laughs> 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 Jokes. It oh. wasn't a Claire. It wasn't a Claire. Oh, that is brilliant. Eclair? I love an eclair. I love an eclair. Oh, wait, like the chewy ones though, or like a one with cream in? One with cream in. Yeah. Yeah, definitely one with cream in. Oh, he's in eclair right now. I'm starving. Oh, look at him. Famished. Should have been. I was late though. You were late. I was late late. You were. But that's that's traffic. for Sunday drivers, mate. Oh, tell me about Sunday the Sunday drivers. drivers. Sunday drivers. That's another thing. That's another ick. That is an ick. Oh. Sunday driver. Middle lane hoggers. Yeah. Oh. Rats, man. Rats. Rats. Snakes. Middle lane hoggers, though. It's even more so the fact that 
you've got these smart motorways now that are four lanes mm. and people just still refuse to stay in the left hand lane because they still think it's three lanes you know what I do actually want to speak about this week go on have you seen about these spy balloons oh god yeah spy balloons what on earth what on earth is going on? What do you think they are? So, the NSA come out and said, we've just blew up... Who's the NSA? In America. It's the National... NASA? No, because that, that that's NASA. Oh. I've not pronounced NASA wrong. Okay, NSA. National Space Agency. No, no. National it, Security Awareness. Might, might be National Security. National... The NSA in America. Squid. National Security Agency. Oh! You were so close. Mm. So the the NSA come out and said, we've shot down this unidentified flying object, spent 400k on one rocket, and it's looking like it's coming out that it was just a $12 hobby balloon. What? So they just blew this thing up. Yeah, but there's things on TikTok where they're like round and like they look metal, and then they go dev fast like different ways. Yeah, I've ways. seen them ones. What I are re- they? I reckon that's just good editing. The Earth's been here for, what, nearly six billion years? Yeah. And just recently we're finding out that we've got aliens. aliens. Yeah. Or, yeah, but what's Area 51? I think it's just a a really secure area. For what? You'll never know. Exactly. Aliens. So you're saying it's six six billion years or whatever. How long's Area 51 been there? Do you know? Not six billion years. Yeah, but maybe they found out and were like, right, we need to keep probably this under wraps. The, probably, well, you had that spacecraft that crashed in New Mexico in the 50s, didn't you? Don't know. In Roswell. It? And that's where Area 51 come about because they kept it <gasps> hush hush. Aliens then? I think it's 93% of all alien spacecraft sightings are in America. Mm. <laughs> they can't just go, oh, we're going to go there. It's, <laughs> yeah. It's warmer. <laughs> I like it there. <laughs> Maybe they do, though. Maybe there's a reason why they go to America. I don't know why it's so hush-hush. But then did you hear about the um, the farm things that were happening? Oh, crop circles. Yeah, oh, what's that? Oh, stop it. I think it's just a bloke going around with a stick, squashing his crops. Yeah, but it can't be the one bloke that owns all of the different Not farms. Not all of them. I think people just want to jump on a bandwagon. No, I don't. Yeah. No. Why, why are that crop circle? Why that crop circle? Why that shape? Aliens. <laughs> Pyramids. We're getting a bit conspiracy. I love conspiracy. Conspiracy. Is that a word? Conspiracists. Yeah. I love a good conspiracy theory, I really do. Do you think Michael Jackson's dead? No. No, me neither. No, I don't think <gasps> what he is. about a <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny. What about the guy in the in the in the plane? A passenger? You're gonna <laughs> you're gonna have to elaborate on that. Um Kobe? Kobe Bryant. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was sad. That was a helicopter but crash. Didn't he predict that though? Uh, I don't know. A lot of people predict it. How many people have got on a plane and gone, Oh, I think it's gonna crash and then the plane crashes. Mm. Who's gonna know? What about the whole Simpsons thing as well? Now the Simpsons one really, really, really Freaky. blows my yeah. mind. But, but it's not like it's fa- even down to the T though where you know the Donald Trump one where he's coming down, coming the, escalator. down the escalator. It's perfectly, perfectly the exact same. How it exactly was. Yeah. And, it, and I, I can't provide an answer with There's that. There's no explanation. Crazy. Time traveller. Yeah. Time traveller. That's the only thing. Unless Donald Trump's gone. I'm going to do that. <laughs> I've, I've yeah. seen it on Simpsons. I'm going to do that. That's a possibility. It's, I mean, Donald Trump. It's a possibility. Donald Trump. He's a bit nuts, isn't he? And how is it mm. an accident that Ebola is a thing? Yeah. And Simpsons predicted that. What else did they predict? Some... FaceTime. Oh, yeah, FaceTime. Yeah, pandemic. Yeah, the, yeah. God, there's just loads of Simpsons. There's loads. But there's some stuff that the Simpsons have predicted that's not come true. Yet. No, like, we've gone past the date where it, it should have come true, but oh. it's not. So, yeah, I've gone past that. Mm. But have you seen these time travellers on TikTok? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Doing it for follows. Sometimes I save them, though, because I think, oh, nah. it might happen. Yeah. I've seen one self-proclaimed time traveller. <laughs> he was called Beggy Mitchell. <laughs> who just wants followers. My <laughs> God. In the year 2394. <laughs> who's going to be alive to see that? TikTok won't even be alive then. No, it won't. It'll be taken down because America don't like them. 
And yeah. they would have just wiped them out because it's in China. Ooh. Because America want to ban TikTok in America. America want to? America want to block TikTok because it's a Chinese company. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was American. No. China just sat back. Like, oh, yeah. there's another uni. Yeah. We'll just give them 40% of that. Yeah, they've smashed it, haven't they? Smashed it. Right. Each week, we're going to do a diary entry for like one thing that happened in like that a, week. Like a journal. A journal. <laughs> so this week, Tim's going to share his diary entry with us. My... Most exciting thing that happened this week. No, 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 no. Thursday the 16th of February, I was feeding Isla and I was making a laugh and she just gave out the cutest little giggle. She's eight weeks old and she started laughing and, and that proper cheered me up. And it's nearly got five million views on in, on TikTok. <laughs> that was great, but... Yeah. What's yours? <laughs> when are we alternate? Yeah. We zoom. <laughs> You this week, me next week. No, I'll do it. we'll just do it. Okay. Um, ooh, someone's not written. Oh, I will tell you something that happened. It's not funny and it's not cute and it's not anything good. It's something bad. Oh my god! It's something bad. Someone broke Maria light on my car. I'm glad you said light on your car. Yeah. Because <laughs> if you would have just finished <laughs> up saying someone broke my rear. <laughs> Yeah. You said this. You, yeah. Um, so I'm um, not happy. Has the person claimed responsibility for it? So it was a delivery person who done it and he was like meh, 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 meh. and I said, Whoa <laughs> Where are you from? <laughs> meh, 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 meh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said to him, Well, apologize. And that'll fix your light, will it? <laughs> no. But I just thought, my god, rude, like apologize to me. So he was like, Well, not my not my fam. Not my fault. So I was like, no, no, it's your fault. So I rang his head office and was like, it's his fault. So they were like, mm, it might not be his fault. So they're looking into it. Like, well. Right, we're just having some snacks and Jade, mm. oh no, Tim. Tim. Kindly brought us up a snack train. And it's elite. It's elite. Elite. So I'll talk you through. We've got fruit winers. Yeah. Oh, winders. <laughs> fruit wine dares. <laughs> we've got fruit winders we've got gold bars gold bars the most underrated chocolate bar in the world mm. Mm. caramel surrounding biscuit shut your mouth they are the best mm-hmm. mm. I'm eating a breakaway mm. breakaway it's wicked <laughs> a lot of people remember that advert there's, a, there's one loose Crave sticks. I don't know what they are, but they look you know nice. The, you know the Kellogg's breakfast cereal, Crave? Crave? Yeah. It's that in a breakfast Yeah, bar. I gathered that, but I've never had it. Well, it's well nice. Put that down. Yorkie biscuit. You're not allowed that. <laughs> <laughs> they're actually banging. They're better than a an actual Yorkie. Yeah, they are. Mm. But not for you. You're a girl. Double decker. I'm not, I'm not a huge fan. I'm not going to lie. How can you not? Mm-hmm. So, a double decker is made out of biscuit, chocolate, nougat. Do you call it nougat yeah. or nougat or nugget? Nougat. Nougat. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call it? Nougat. That's nougat. It's nougat. <laughs> nougat. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Tortellini. No, because nugget, nugget, nugget. <laughs> oh, yeah, now you've said it more than once again. <laughs> no, oh, good, good, good. Oh, nugget, nugget. nugget. No. Well, a lot of people pronounce it nougat. Are they wrong? Yeah. That's like funny. Funny. <laughs> <laughs> nougat. It's nougat. Nougat. <laughs> Isn't it? No one's ever called it nougat. Have they? Let me Google it. Nougat. How to pronounce nougat? Nougat. Oh, it's nougat. 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 Oh, sorry. Turn it off. Nougat. Nougat. <laughs> 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 right, we'll cut that off. Yeah, no, I'm not, I, I don't like double decker. No, me neither. Right, let's move on. What? Moving on. What did he say? <laughs> no, moving on. <laughs> 
crunchy. It's crunchy. Oh, God. Oh, I um, got to stop oh. this now. Stop. <laughs> Chocolate buttons. Oh, Rolo. <laughs> <laughs> you done? No. What are you laughing at, Tim? Do you want to share it with the group? <laughs> Nougat. <laughs> Rolo. I'm going to stick with Nugget. Yeah, yeah, Nugget, 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 Nugget. Rolo. Nougat. Who? <laughs> No, Rolo. 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 Banging. Do you remember the Bangin. advert for that? And it was it was always no. Do you love anyone enough to give them your last Rolo? No. <laughs> Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I've already had the pack. I'm not giving anyone the last one. Rolos. So good. Plus freezer <laughs> equals <laughs> heavy weaponry. Right? <laughs> My god. Put them in the freezer, guys. Give it a go. Anyway, moving on. No, don't put them in the freezer. Keely wheely. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! I didn't even know I had that in there. That is elite. That frozen as well. Oh, what's it called? Keely wheely. <laughs> oh, I'm going to go downstairs and get a can of Coke. <laughs> Original, I like it. Oh, I'm going KFC and I'm going to get some chicken. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Linda. <gasps> oh, yeah. Salted caramel, that one. Oh, no, I don't like salted caramel. You can have that one. Oh, you... Don't like... Oh, does salted caramel... Yeah. Twix? Salted caramel Twix. Salted caramel... Caramel. Caramel. Salted caramel. Because my mouth's... <laughs> wow. <laughs> Why is it melted? How hot's my kitchen? Where's the biscuit? <laughs> I mean, you're not going to see this, but I've got to investigate why this is so... Unbiscuity. <laughs> oh, you're spilling it everywhere. Jade, it was him, not me. Hoover. Mm. Oh, it's got biscuit. It's got I found biscuit. a biscuit. Wow, that, that is, is melted. I don't like salted caramel, me. Oh, I love salted caramel. Salted caramel, anything. Mm. Nah. Chocolate buttons, and then we're, that's it. That's it. Elite. Oh, we've got these fibre squares as well, but they're also salted caramel, so they can go in room 101. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk about that. Oh, Room 101. Let's talk about Room 101. Right, so this is stuff that I just don't want to exist anymore. We. Why do we do that? It's, it's quite selfish, really. It is. So, well, yeah, this is something that I don't want to exist. You've got what you don't want to exist. Yeah, but so as... we've both got a Room 101. But a, a Room 101, mine's nearly full. Mm-hmm. And it's a big room, mm. but this is just stuff that I, I can't stand. It's stuff that I don't want in my life anymore. But you have to explain why. Because it serves no purpose, and I hate it. Tell me what it is. Well, I've got loads now. <laughs> okay. I've got lo- like Sunday drivers. Yeah, they can go in room one hundred and one. <laughs> they can go. Straight it's just in took the bin. me what two hours yeah. to do a forty-minute drive. Yeah. What else do I? I just hate people. <laughs> <laughs> just people in general people. as soon as Mars is open I'm off yeah. <laughs> would you actually yeah would you yeah, I'd go to Mars any day of the week NASA if you're listening I'll be your guinea pig get me really would you though yeah r- I don't r- if they rocked up tomorrow with the rocket outside your house I think I don't think you'd get in it my bags are packed <laughs> send me in a rocket but you've mate. just got a new baby I'll come back oh imagine it was like interstellar though where yeah, but you have to Every sign... Every second seconds is a year. Oh, my God. Imagine it be like that. I mean, it's not because we're in the solar system. Yeah, but... Flat earthers can get in room 101. <laughs> the earth might be flat. It might be. Yeah, but it's not. <laughs> but it might be. Yeah, but it's not. How is it flat? How is it flat? Because it might be. How... Because How I'm, not, that? I'm not a flat earther, but I'm not a round earther either. I just think... Oblong. <laughs> <laughs> no, when you stand on the beach and you look at the horizon, it's flat. It's not flat. It is. It's not flat. It is. It's not. I don't know. It's definitely not. There's images from live streamed from astronauts. Yeah, but they... And it's round. Yeah. But do you also believe that we were first on the moon? No. 
Well, I don't think we've been to the moon. Yeah, so them. if they're going to lie about... Conspiracy. If they're going to lie about going to the moon, they'll lie about these shots that they're so-called getting about the Earth being round. Nah. Hmm? These no. flat earthers are the, are the same people that are saying that there's a dome. Like the Simpsons movie? It's not, it's not like that. <laughs> I'm not happy with flat earthers at all. If you're a flat earther, you're wrong. They might not be, but it's like ghosts and stuff as well. Like Ghosts. So ghosts aren't real. And a lot of okay. people are going to say, oh, I've seen one. You've not. I don't know how you can say that because your house is definitely haunted. But I've not seen a ghost. Yeah, but you can't rule them out completely. Most Haunted, I've had four billion series and not one seen a ghost. I believe in energy. Mm. Energies are definitely real because you can't just stop energies. Okay, but explain. Uh, remember that TikTok and the chair moved? Right. I can't explain that. Exactly. So you can't rule out ghosts. I, ca- I can't. What, like a, an apparition? A what? I need to get someone intelligent to do this a ba- podcast with me. A, ba- a, <laughs> a what? An apparition. Apparition? Apparition. Apparition. Yeah. What is that? So an apparition is a form of a being that is spiritual. Oh. Okay, maybe we won't see a ghost, but there's definitely a ghost in this house. So there's definitely an energy in this house. What's an energy? An energy is something of something that was, but it's not stopped. So you think it's a person? Was. Oh, okay. Was. I think it's the energy. I'm not having... Something that's dead, you can see it. So Mm. if that was the case, you'd be able to see birds, dogs, any roadkill. Have you ever seen the ghost of an ant? Yeah. Knocking about. So what do you think happens when we pop our clogs? When we pop our clogs, no one knows. But you know them people who get put into comas? Mm. And they're like, oh, I've just seen this, I've just seen this. How many people are put into an injolt? In- How many people are put into an injolt coma? <laughs> Why did I go Yorkshire then? <laughs> How many people are put into an induced coma a day all around the world? Eight billion people in the world, and there's only the odd one story that comes out and goes. I- Normally, America. I just seen God, and he <laughs> said, "That's it. Now I'm going back to my trailer." <laughs> Do you see what I mean? I see what you mean. It, it's just, I mean, it, it's completely open to suggestion what happens yeah. when we pop our clogs. What I like to believe is that you're still roaming, but... Roman camp. <laughs> roaming. <laughs> roaming camp. Sorry. You're still... Ronan Keaton. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, but how long does no, your I'm not energy... To you, <laughs> how long does your energy stay? Forever? I don't, yeah, maybe forever. I don't really like to think about it. That's the end. Okay, that, that's a great segment. <laughs> um, thanks for listening, guys. <laughs> right, I think because I've lost people close to me, like I want to believe mm. that like they've gone to this lovely heaven and all of that, but really I believe nothing happens like you. Nothing. But then I'm like, surely not. Like, surely this isn't just it. So... Do you believe in Jesus? No. 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 I'm, com- I'm completely atheist. Yeah. I just think whatever makes you comfortable, if you believe in that, or yeah. whatever it is that you believe in, it makes you happy, believe it. Yeah. I, I don't believe in our God. I believe in the universe. I believe the universe. Science. Science will, yeah. ne- science will never, ever, ever be proven to be to be proven wrong because it's mm. factual. It's, it's science. It's right. Yeah, I'm the same. But saying that I believe in the universe, manifesting... Mm. manifesting is so true mm. and I know this is accurate because it's happened to me but you've got to understand how it works mm-hmm. you can't just go oh what a million pounds tomorrow and then get a cob on minutes and I'll come to you yeah if you manifest having something so much something it, something, it will eventually happen because yeah. that's manifesting it's drawn to you it really is I wouldn't have the following that I've got on my social medias now 3.3 million on Facebook, 2.2 million on TikTok, nearly got a million on YouTube. I would not have that now if I didn't manifest it. That is not. That's how I know manifesting. Where? And asking the universe works. But you've got to work for it. Don't don't yeah. think it just... But if you work towards something, you work towards a goal. You'll yeah, the it. doors open, don't they? 100%, 100%. But it's even like the podcast. Always wanted me own podcast. Didn't know how I was going to do it or what the plan was. I just knew that I always wanted to be on a podcast. Yeah, and here we are on the podcast. 
crazy. So it definitely does work. Get Manifest- off your phone. He's checking football. I am, yeah. Uh, manifesting really, really, really works. It does. Think about where you were five years ago and where you are now. That's not just coincidence. Mm. That's hard work and believing that I am going to be something better than what I was 10 years ago. Yeah. 100%. I love it. Right? On episode three, we speak about... Episode three. X Crocs. Crocs. Accents. Accents. All sorts. It's, yeah. Episode three is a funny one, it's isn't it? It's so funny. Make sure you tune in. Make sure you follow us on TikTok and Instagram. Make sure you subscribe over on YouTube. It helps us make more content. And that's it. Yeah. Thanks for listening, guys. Now, as always, let's do a beat. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'll start the beat. Oh, yeah. We've got to do a, a goodbye outro. Yeah, we have. Um... <laughs> <laughs> you sound like a train. <laughs> no, you come in, you come in, you come in. <laughs> I wish this had visual so you could oh, see that dance. That's not me and Jade, man. <laughs> My name's Tim. Do you want a drink? (laughs) 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 On that that note, we'll catch you on the next episode. Love you. Bye.